most people don't really understand what actually stem cells do to heal a wound. So I just wanted to talk a little bit about that. You know, whether you cut your skin or you strain your knee joint, the body always goes through what's called the wound healing cascade. So there's three phases to it. The first phase is cause the inflammatory phase. So when you cut your skin or you strain your knee, what's gonna happen is there's gonna be an inflammatory reaction and that inflammatory reaction is gonna cause a lot of substances in the area that are inflammatory like interleukin-1 and cytokines and various growth factors. And what they're trying to do is actually get the stem cells to the area. So the inflammatory phase tries to get healing cells, including stem cells, to the area. Then the next phase of healing is called the proliferative phase, for which prolotherapy is named. So prolotherapy, when, when, I, when I do or an experienced prolotherapy, prolotherapist does prolotherapy, they're helping the injury go through all these phases, the inflammatory phase, then the proliferative phase. Now, once the proliferative phase starts in healing, what's happening is there's the proliferation, not just of cells, but also of the substances that are going to repair the tissue. Skin is made of collagen, ligaments are made of collagen, tendons are made of collagen. So you're, what's happening in the wound or the injury is you're proliferating collagen. So that phase goes on for like four to six weeks. So when we do or I do comprehensive hackett hemwall prolotherapy, we're seeing people every four to six weeks to simulate what normally happens in the human body. Now, after the last prolotherapy session, the person will go through the remodeling phase for up to a year, year and a half. During that time, the collagen is tightening and strengthening. So you can understand that pro prolotherapy is gonna be very effective at curing a lot of pain because all it does is start the healing process that the body normally goes through when it's healing a wound. Why a wound might need or an injury might need prolotherapy is all the structures around the joint, the ligaments, the tendons, the cartilage, the meniscus, the labrum, they're all white. So they have a very poor blood supply thus a poor healing ability. So all we're doing with prolotherapy is inducing the normal wound healing reaction.